Callum Bay here, the only man ever to have beaten McCallum. This one, Callum Bay looking to get back in the big time indoors. McCallum being introduced to the crowd, his record third. First bell, it's due to go 12 rounds, and we expect something special. And how good is McCallum? He's an extremely... People have tried to write him off. His last defend... <laughs> For a former world champion himself, broke into the big league when <laughs> Callum Bay was too quick, too slippery for Callum here in Monte Carlo. You look at fighters like these, these step out of place tonight. You can't let this fight go. Ended in a traumatic 88 second early to get back into the major league into lay preacher originally from jamaica now based in new york errol graham like milton mccrory well it really is something boxing callum bay there coming forward and look you know he only does what's necessary to to win a fight callum bay out of range a couple of times with the jab you know you had callum bay dancing around using the left hand but it never happened, did it? Yes, the strategy, the strategy was for me to... get some useful hooks to the body as well and made Callum Bay miss a fair bit in this race. He's a, he's a great fighter. He knows how to pace himself. He paces himself. Callum Bay just looks a little bemused at the moment. Mike is making things very difficult. He's, he's timing. Here's some of the action again from this uh, second round, Michael. Good body shot, that. And this is where it's going to matter most. It's due to go 12, and I wouldn't be a bit surprised if it did go to But now living in Chiavavare, Italy. This is the test of whether he is. He's acquitting himself pretty well so far. Bay, really, than uh, McCallum. The question over Callum Bay is... Really ...on that performance. You know, the first round knockout. He's also... Shot. I think McCallum... In ...distance. And the left, the right hook. I wonder what she's making of it so far. Looks a bit anxious. Well, you never see him taking a, a clean shot on the chin. He, you know, he moves... Stop boxing! Well, that was a closer round than the second or the fourth. McCallum in the black trunks. Callum Bay in white. Really trained very hard, hard in, um, in the chin. I was watching Mike... Before. Jab. That comes Callum Bay. He's made to miss. Very effective. Don Curry knocking him out in five. Knocked out Julian Jackson, the current WBC. You know why? He's, he's been avoided by all these, all these top men in boxing. That was a good right from Callum Bay, but he was caught on the. He's really warmed to his task now. Now he's taken up the pace. They are certainly a class act. There they are. Callum defending his WBA middleweight title against Sambu. <laughs> Does he hit up at middleweight, Michael? He, he's, he's not a devastator. He gives, you know, he doesn't give you any breathing space. He's just, he's just remarkable. He, he keeps inside and he keeps working. Thrown with great hand speed inside there. Clever. Good mobility. Callum Bay coming. Good body punching again there from McCallum. And then, you know, and then you know what you've got to do. You know what you've got to do to, to pick up. Then down. Beautiful. This is world-class boxing at its best. I think Columbia is beginning to feel the pressure. Down the ground, and he reckoned that uh, boxing was a good deal safer than... Becomes certainly warm to the task now. He's, you know, he's getting in closer they get, you know, the more... The more. May have to vary the game plan he came in with someday, but I don't think it's going to be just yet. He These guys are lively. You know, he still looks very fresh. Much watching in the corner, the... Uh, Great old tra having him in the corner is a big plus as well for McCallum. Great training, Fudge. He's been with the took from Callum Bay. And McCallum took it very well. I felt very decided. Well, if George Foreman can go in at 42, I think it's his hope. Look at this from McCallum. Body shots and that. No. And so far, he's, 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 winning, he's winning the fight. Definitely looking strong. Seventh round, not working at ringside with us. There's more Columbia's left, the left hand. It would be to jab and move, make things very awkward. He's just having probably his worst half a minute of the contest so far. 
Now Kalambe looks rejuvenated. Kalambe found it very hard in the first encounter to tag to tag Kalambe. But Coyle has, and that was uh, one. Ex is being made to think again here. It's true. Kalambe from Kalambe there on those rips. There's no doubt this has been his best round of the contest. Really sent the sweat spraying off the face of McCallum as it landed. So they won't be noticing that these two in the ring. Eighth round. I find it very frustrating. To it. Markley over 15 on points. Now that shows durability. If you can go fifth. The fight he lost, as I was telling you earlier, in 88. Made his name beating Errol Graham. And it was against Barkley that Callum. This is similar to the first encounter they had back in Italy. Surprised that um, McCallum hasn't hit below the belt. In the last couple of rounds, he's stunning home the jab now. He's making the right of your picture, defending his WBA middleweight title. McCallum has to start stepping up the pace. He's giving Callum a the ninth round or into the ram through the guard of McCallum and then the jab once twice it could become quite close but uh, McCallum left hands perfectly so the fighter as good as Buster Drayton oh look at that right again it's like hitting a mountain side really yes. isn't it nothing happens he's, he's you know he's due by and large you can say the same thing about Callum Bay good chopping right there from McCallum this is better from him right. That's what Mike McCullum wants for Columbia. A very fine fight indeed. This is two great technicians at their best. Yeah. More action again from the last round, and that's that good right over the top. Uh, the definite impression that Callum Bay is coming back. And Both, you know, they've been tested. Oh, by Callum Bay. Trading punch for punch in this round. Really pace. Work his body shots, because that's where it matters most. So, that's uh, lovely boxing skills. This is the same. This fight is certainly a classic. He's showing a lot down the stretch. Look at the way he's slipping those punches from McCallum. Plummer has a habit of going on ropes. What do you think here now? Let's have a look at the close quarter. 11th round coming up, just two to go. So looking to gate crash and get his name on. Well, undisputed. Mice is poking that left hand. Uh, it should double up more in his left hand. But I still have McCallum in front by... An <laughs> working away, still relentlessly coming forward. Good body shot. Things very awkward for Mike McCallum. He's not looking as effective. It's a good body shot back though from Callum Bay that time. Then the right to the head. And um, just looking through my scorecard as we watch back. That was a good right from McCallum. As they come up now for the 12th and final round. They touch and the crowd thoroughly enjoying this as we... <laughs> just one round ahead going into the last round. On my scorecard I've got a conditioned. The pace, the skills. Stick to the body from... Callum Bay in there. I don't know whether it got. Yes, Callum Bay is looking. Venezuela and Spain are seeing this. Oh, was that a. And he's making making things very hard for the, the two of them throwing in everything here. In half of it. Most definitely. Callum Bay's left it a little bit. You know, he's placed himself very well, and both of them is going at their team. Callum Bay has come back terrifically in the second half. Fell. This is going to go to the judges' scorecards. What a terrific goal. McCallum wins it on the second judges' scorecards. One six for the decision of the three judges. That was the slip. It was McCallum has won it on a split decision. Once out, the only defeat on his record after a terrific fight here.